hearing for some time about pirates. It's just, they had a very unhealthy lifestyle. If only they'd searched for their buried treasure on bikes instead of boats, they would have been trim, taut and terrific. What? I'm getting into character. Character. <laughs> Let's go. Arr! Yep, my little pirate pals may be questioning my sanity, but they are into the quest for buried treasure, by hook or by crook. And this is a healthy, fun way to do it. Grab a map from the bike shop here at Sydney Olympic Park, get your helmet on, and even rent a bike if you need. Then we're off on a very different kind of race, the amazing chase. What percentage of the existing salt marsh was retained when the boardwalk was constructed? <laughs> That's a difficult question. It must be written here somewhere. Aha! There's lots of questions that need answers. And there are six pit stops around the park to find them, which means you're not just discovering new parts of the park, you're getting smarter by the minute. If pirates had had to solve puzzles, they would have been smarter too. <laughs> oh, it's a bit spooky in here, isn't it? You can race each other like crazy, form teams if you like, or take all day to do it and have a look around while you're here. There are plenty of hidden treasures, like the mangrove boardwalk. Oh, wait, they're not jewels and gold. They're just very shiny crabs. But down the road a little are some amazing shipwrecks that most definitely shiver me timbers. Don't tell these guys, but they're actually learning a heap. Problem solving, map reading, history. And they're getting fit. And they're not noticing. There's so much to keep everyone busy and interested. After all, Sydney Olympic Park has over 500 hectares of public space, including Bicentennial Park, which is celebrating its 25th anniversary this year. And let's not forget, this is an excellent spot for seeing wildlife. So lucky our next pit stop is a very special bird hide. Just remember to stop your race and have a look every now and then. You never know what you might see. They put their beaks yeah. together and made a love heart shape. Yeah. Like I saw before. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah. But back on your bikes, because we've still got a chance to make a new record. Just hand over your answers, give back your bikes, and blow me down, you hearties. There's your treasure. See that? Ha-ha. Of course you don't. <laughs> Come on, we're not going to tell you what it is. You have to get your own treasure. <laughs> come on. <laughs> you can still come with us to our final pit stop. And the girls seem to think it's the most important one. Cold Rock Ice Creamery has just opened here at Sydney Olympic Park. And that means sweet treats for every one of your crew. Mulberry treasure. <laughs> Where's mine? Get into gear with the amazing chase at Sydney Olympic Park. It's free. It's Bicentennial Park's 25th anniversary this year. And with so much to do and see, there's plenty to celebrate. Check it all out at sydneyolympicpark.com.au.